West Ham get away with a surprising draw with Arsenal. League One, Forest Green are relegated. All this and more on this very late edition of The Goal Line. Hello guys and welcome to the goal line. Um, it's a very late goal line. I do apologise. Um, last night was a very busy night for me. Um, Travelling here, there and everywhere. It's very, very busy. Sorry if you can hear any background noise. Um, I am in my living room and my noisy neighbours are next door and I've got the uh, disadvantage of traffic. Um, anyway, I do so. I do apologise for this very late twenty-four hour, um, twenty-four hour late edition of the goal line. Um, so yeah, um, the game today was quite interesting. Um, Arsenal, um, or oh, sorry, West Ham took on Arsenal um, in a surprising shocker of a draw. Um, Arsenal had gone two new in front. Um, um, they um but Arsenal let um slip a two a, a two goal um lead to draw at West Ham. Um so yeah, it was good good thing for West Ham fans. Um I think Arsenal were too gentle against West Ham if I'm honest. Um one of them was a penalty. Um but hey a draw is a draw, right? I suppose you're gonna have to take whatever um you can get. Um, so getting some gun out here. Sorry if it's too loud. Um, oh yeah, no. Um, I'll just put that one by the way. Um, oh, yeah, so Arsenal let that slip. Um, other news, um, this is obviously today's games I'm talking about. Um, Man United had a 2-0 victory against um, struggling Nottingham Forest uh, yeah, any of you who have teams in League 1 or follow the League 1 table will know that Forest Green yesterday got relegated um, back to League 2 they just couldn't hang um, the problem with Forest Green is um the problems didn't even start this season. It started, I think, when it was in League Two. When they were still in League Two, and right at the bottom of the table, and then towards the end of the season, they started to, you know, there wasn't a lot of gas left in the tanks. I don't think, uh, to be quite frank, and they gave away. I think it was like a thirteen point uh, in front, right at the top. And then Exeter got involved and they finished like neck and neck. But I think Forest Green actually won League Two. Obviously promoted to League One. Just couldn't hang in League One. So, and now relegated back to League Two. So, I suppose that's kind of where the wheels came off, really. Um, which is a shame. I didn't want Forest Green to go, but... Quite frankly, they're, they're a team who needs to go back to League 2, find out where they went wrong, rip through League 2, back to League 1. Is it going to happen next season? I've got no idea. But they need to go back to the drawing board because that ain't working what they've done. Uh, in other uh, news, um, Chelsea women beat uh, Aston Villa women to reach the Women's FA Cup final. Um, Celtic done Kilmarnock uh, 4 1, I think it is. Um, so, yeah, um, that is sort of the um, that's the result, that's just kind of news for today. What I'm going to do though is, uh, like last time, I'm going to go through all the scores um, from yesterday first. Um, in case any of you have been too busy to 
really, uh, get the results or can watch match of the day or final score. So yesterday, um, Saturday the 15th of April, Aston Villa 3, Newcastle 0, Chelsea 1, Brighton 2, Everton 1, Fulham 3, Southampton 0, Crystal Palace 2, Wolves 2, Brentford 0, Tottenham 2, Bournemouth 3 and Man City 3, Leicester 1. Um, into the AFL Championship, um, Sheffield United 4, Cardiff 1, Blackpool 1, Wigan 0, Millwall 2, Preston 0, QPR 0, Coventry 3, Reading and Burnley was a 0 0, Rotherham 0, Luton 2, Stoke 1, West Brom 2, Sunderland 2, Birmingham 1, Swansea 1, Huddersfield 0, Watford 2, Bristol City 0, and Blackburn and Hull was a 0 0 draw. Into League 1, Exeter 0, Plymouth 1, Cambridge 2, Peterborough 0, Accrington 2, Fleetwood 5, Bristol Rose 1, Derby 1, Burton 3, Sheffield Wednesday 2, um, Forest Green 1, Barnsley 5, as I said that's what confirmed the relegation yesterday, Ipswich 6, Charlton 0, uh, Lincoln City 3, Port Vale 2, MK Dons 2, Cheltenham 2, Morecambe 1, Wickham 0, Oxford United 0, Bolton 1, and Shrewsbury and Portsmouth was a 1-1 draw. Um, the FA Women's, uh, there was one Women FA Cup match yesterday, um, Man United Women 3, Brighton Women 2. If we're going to the EFL League 2, Carlisle and Northampton was a 0-0. Uh, Crawley 2, Tranmere 1, Crew 2, Walsall 0, Gillingham and Stockport and Grimsby and Mansfield was 1-1 draws. Harrogate and Doncaster was 2-2. Two, two. Um, Newport 2, Hartlepool 0, Rochdale 0, Bradford 3. Salford 0, Colchester 1, Stevens 2, Wimbledon 1, Sutton United 0, Leighton Orient 2, and Swindon 0, Barrow 0. Into the National League, Barnet 0, Wrexham 0, Aldershot 2, Scunthorpe 1, Boronwood 1, Willstone 0, Chesterfield 3, EC 2, Dorking 3, Altrincham 2, Halifax 3, Maidstone 2, um, Already relegated, um, Maidstone United nil, Gateshead nil, Bromley three, Oldham one, Maidenhead nil, um, Solihull Moors and um, relegated, um, well sorry, relegation threatened Yeovil. Um, was a two two, so Solihull Moors and Yeovil, um, Southend two, Dagenham Redbridge nil, Torquay three, York two, Notts County three, Woking nil. Um, for the National League North, Blythe Spartans 2, Curzon Ashton 2, Boston United 0, Flyde 1, Brackley Town 3, Darlington, Darlington 0, Bradford Park Avenue 1, um, Banbury United 0, Chester 2, Farsley Celtic 2, Gloucestershire 1, Alfordton 1, Kidderminster 3, Telford 0, Kingsland 3, Southport 2, Leamington 1, Chorley 2, Peterborough Sports 0, Hereford 2, Scarborough nil, Buxton one, and Spinney Moore four, Kettering Town two, and finally into the National League South, um, Bar City four, Concord Rangers nil, Chelmsford five, Hungerford Town one, Dover one, Oxford City five, Dyke Hamlet two, Taunton Town nil, Eastbourne three, Hemel Hempstead nil, Ebbsfleet three, Chesnut nil. Hampton and Richmond 2, Weymouth 1, Haverton and Waterlooville and Chippenham Town was 1-1. One, one. Slough Town 2, Farnborough 0, um, St Albans 3, Welling 0, Tunbridge 0, Dartford 1 and Worthing 2, Braintree 1. Um, so we're just, I'm just going to quickly go through um, the, some of the results from today. Um, as, as I said, uh, West Ham 2, Arsenal 2 and Nottingham Forest 0, Man United 2 um, Scottish Premiership obviously Kilmarnock 1, um, Celtic 4 as I said um, So that's all that's uh, 
been doing for today. We have got a Premier League game tomorrow at 8 o'clock. It's between Leeds and Liverpool. So make sure you listen or watch on the telly. Um, so if we go to the Premier League table. Um, Arsenal are first with 74 points. Man City 70. Man United 59. Newcastle 56. Tottenham 53. Aston Villa 50. Brighton 49, Liverpool 44, Brentford 43, Fulham 42, Chelsea 39, Crystal Palace 36, 34, um, Wolves are 34, Bournemouth are 33, um, West Ham are 31, um, Leeds are 29, Everton are 27, and then in the relegation places is Nottingham Forest 27 points, Leicester is 25th and rock bottom of Southampton is on 23. Um, so that is the tables, uh, the Premier League table as it stands. Um, if you do, if, feel free, um, any Scottish fans who want me to um, do more of the Scottish results as well and the tables, feel free. I don't mind doing it, but you need to below, uh, comment below. And let me know um, if there's any other sort of sport, any other sort of football that people want me to, um, um, you know, get involved with. Um, if you, if there's any um, any tables you want to see, any scores you want you to read out, please feel free to let me know, and I'll know to do it for next week. Okay, guys. Um, well, that's it for the moment. Um, for the goal line um, again apologies for it being on a Sunday night I do apologise um, but there might be people out there who couldn't watch final score or couldn't watch match of the day um, so that's the results um, hopefully I'll be back this Saturday next week um, but until then guys thank you very much for watching the goal line and I'll see you next week ciao for now guys thank you